Hello, my name is Mary and I am a member of the Respect Life Committee of St. Joseph Catholic Church in Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. Our committee is pleased to invite you to join us in praying the nine days of life novena. Today is January 25th, day five. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Today we pray that each person suffering from the loss of a child through abortion may find hope and healing in Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. After more than four decades of legalized abortion, many children's lives have been ended and many parents and family members suffer that loss, often in silence. Yet God's greatest desire is to forgive. No matter how far we have each strayed from his side, he says to us, don't be afraid, draw close to my heart. Be assured that it is never too late to seek God's forgiveness in the sacrament of reconciliation. Consider the parable of the prodigal son. After repenting of sinning against his father, he returned from far away to seek forgiveness and work as a servant. But the father sees him approaching, runs to warmly embrace him, and hosts a banquet to celebrate his return. So too does God welcome all his repentant children no matter how serious the sin. Let us, let us turn confidently to our Lord, who is love and mercy. Each day of the novena, we are challenging ourselves to make an act 
of reparation. Here are some options to choose from. Option one, abstain from meat today. Option two, pray the chaplet of divine mercy for those who are suffering the loss of a child through abortion, asking that they find healing and peace. A link with instructions on how to pray the chaplet can be found below. And another option would be to offer some other sacrifice, prayer, or act of penance that you feel called to do for today's intention. Thank you for praying the Novena with us today. We hope you'll join us again tomorrow. Have a blessed day.